Oh, we're live. We're live right now. Morning, everybody. Good Kelly, morning. Kelly was just calling Hi. me. So, to let um, her know I was yeah, right that here. was just to let me know. Yeah. <laughs> Good morning, everybody. So we are live today at the Jewel, the grocery the store Jewels. here, the Jewels. We're at the grocery store here in Dyer. If you watched us last week, um, Kelly and I were at Kelly's house and we were doing all of the meal prepping and told you guys that we wanted to bring it to the grocery store so you could see how shopping the perimeter of the grocery store is a real thing. Okay, so we came armed with our list. All right, I told y'all you should have a list. You gotta, you gotta plan it, then you gotta come pick it up, then you gotta prep it, and then you gotta pack it. Okay, so we made our list. We made a plan of what we're gonna buy. Kelly's got hers, I've got mine. I actually even pulled a recipe out. From. Now listen, y'all. We do not have a cameraman this morning. Oh, okay, and that's I cannot, dangerous. I cannot control the lights. So I, I cannot mean, control her. She so. can't control me. I cannot control her. God knows anything can happen. Jewel doesn't know we're even here today. <laughs> so there's a good we're, chance we're gonna get security to take us out of here. I don't even know what's about to happen. We're gonna try to get this done in 30 minutes. So morning, Dr. Vaught. Thanks for always watching, Dr. Vaught. Give us a shout out. Who's watching us right now? Who wants to meet us at the grocery store? That man does he not. He surely does not. I mean, these people, people are think, avoiding us people like at, we have a Yeah, deep. people at 7 in the morning. We've been They're here like, for a half Rrr. hour. They think we're crazy. We are. Okay. But I did. I pulled a recipe. Look how yummy this looks. This is just a yummy salad that I pulled out. And it's good. It looks delicious. Yeah, so I'm like, okay, hey, I'll shop for some of those things. But listen, so we walked into the grocery store. Now, grocery stores once upon a time used to be set up much differently. Morning, Karen. The bread used to be here, right? We talked about the, the food pyramid. Yes. Um, me and Kelly were talking about that off camera, but the food pyramid that we grew up in, it was like all grains. Like you needed like a hundred servings of grains. They were at the bottom. And then, yeah, and then like the protein was at the top, this in the little, in the little part of the pyramid. So when you used to walk into the grocery store, it was like all the bread when you came in. So now they have changed things. You walk into produce. So I've even learned to create my list that way. Like I know to get all of the produce first. So. Where, what's on your list, Cal? My list is a little different, but I go, like, I think of how when I'm preparing a meal, I do, like, my proteins, Good. then my veggies, my fruits, which is minimal, condiments, and then, like, nut butters or whatever else I'm buying. But I think of how I prep a meal, and then and I... And all the things that you're going to need. Right. So Perfect. I go with the big part first, which is protein. Okay, and I think because I'm at the grocery store, like, nine times a week, I, I do. I go, okay, now I'm going to hit the produce first, and then eggs and meats and things like that. Oh, so I didn't put eggs. All right, well, hey, we're nice. going to get some eggs. We're here. Does anybody need anything while we're here? We're going to be at the gym after this. Um, so I'm right. doing 8 a.m. strength, so meet me there. All right, 8 a.m. strength, Midwest. And then tonight, I'm going to be at Midwest teaching 5 and 6 o'clock. So, all right, people are... Do you are, want me to push this? You, you push the card. I'm going to shop for things. All right, so here we are, guys. We're in the perimeter, so I'm going. I'm going. I'm getting it. What am I getting for you? We need some spinach. Yep, bagged whatever, bagged lettuce, we need bagged some salad. avocados. Oh, avocados are a must. Why am I the only one on the camera? Should I be holding it at you? <laughs> oh, I, right, I got this. I got some avocados. Um, got some avocados. All right, Kelly, you get what you need. We got peppers. You got peppers? I got some peppers. So, guys, we're still in the perimeter. Now, look at here. I want to show everybody this, Kel. This is something new that Jewel is doing. Jewel has... What do you got? No, I was oh, yeah, this is amazing. Item. Look what Jewel has, guys. This is at the Jewel and Dyer. Jewel. Um, they have got already prepped That's in a bag. It's awesome. meat. It's called Meals in Minutes. And this is some nice, look, it's fresh fish and it's vegetables. It's already packed up. All you got to do so is amazing. put it in this bag and cook it. Like it's ready to go. So they've already got ready to go meals. They've got fish with. Wow. Um, and then they got, uh, this is like a Cajun chicken with rice. So nice going jewel, thumbs up. Salmon. Um, they've got salmon, right? Mm -hmm. So they got a salmon, a tilapia. I think they've got some shrimp and some chicken. All in these really great ready to go. So again, we're in the perimeter, okay? So um, they got a nice salad bar here. This is something else, guys, because they've got a salad bar at Jewel. I, I always think about what I'm doing for the rest of the day. So I'm like, you know what? Maybe I'll grab a salad to have yeah. on. Yep. So I'll just have that already ready to go in a container. And then, yep. Okay. So, so smart. I'm trying. I, I try, I'm trying, girl. Trying, please. I'm trying. All right. So we're getting. All right. So you get the things that you need here. I'm gonna get a little. Bit Stop of telling salad. me what to do. And, uh, let's talk about lunch meats too. Oh yeah. Talk about lunch meats. All 
All right. So Kelly, I think what here, let me sh get this on you. What do we What do we think about lunch? Um, as long as they're nitrate free okay. and low sodium. Okay. Because sometimes I like to have sliced turkey. This yes. Is a little like a little snack I do sometimes. FYI, I do sliced turkey and I'll wrap it around a pickle and. Ooh. It's just, it's yummy and it's a little crunchy and I like that, so, okay, um, good idea. yeah. How am I watching? Right, oh, what about hummus with the turkey? Hummus with the turkey's good, too. I okay. mean, so I, that's something else we why, can you're the one that knows all this. Right? I know. Yeah, well, you, Girl. Know, you got some, you got some knowledge. I got some knowledge. Got some knowledge. All right, I got me a little salad here, guys, for that's later. a lot of salad. Okay, it really is a lot of salad. I got a big salad for later. All right, so now we did, we did some veggies. Oh, I lost my list. Oh my goodness. We're a hot mess here. Um, now, cheese. If we're gonna do cheese, guys, I say goat cheese is my favorite. Goat cheese is Kelly's favorite. But honestly, goats have the closest molecular structure to our own DNA. It's crazy and as it that tastes sounds. good. So this is that's why you, people are lactose intolerant. They're really not. I mean, like we have our we produce our own milk for our own species. So we're really not meant to have cow's milk per se or whatever. However, if you are gonna have cow's milk, you're gonna have to go grass fed. We, there's all these alternatives now and they're there for a reason because there are way too many people that are lactose intolerant and have issues with digestion with dairy and that's a real thing because. That's my um, husband. Oh, by the way. I was like, that's Kelly husband. Devine's talking to us yeah, right now. That's, that's amazing. Like, you're talking in your pocket? Um, <laughs> no. So we, I love goat cheese. Um, if you, if you have to have cheese, guys, always go for the white cheese. Go for a low, you know, a, a and they have crumbled version too. Oh yeah, crumbled, crumbled goat cheese is really good for salads, on salads, pizzas. Or in your do that. Eggs. If you could, if you could do that on a pizza, it's good. I know, like, um, I've got a, a dear uh, client Lisa who doesn't it. like it. Yeah, no, that's. Oh yeah, good. And then let's show um, crumbled go goat cheese and eggs. Like if you're making kind of an omelet situation or egg whites. Yes. I put goat cheese in there and spinach. Spinach, good. And then the Parmesan, if you have to do a little bit of that, you could do a little bit of the Parmesan. Mozzarella, all right. If you're gonna do the mozzarella, go for the real thing. If you can, try to get the ones that's already in the, it's already in the water. In the balls. Okay, yeah. So this is the mozzarella you wanna do if you have to do it. And if you do, really light on it. Don't, don't go Yeah, don't. Get cheese. It's hard not to get carried away for me. Okay. I know it's not for so, her, but. All right, yeah. so we did cheese, and now there's hummus here too, guys. I mean, really, organic hummus, if you can get it, is the best. I mean, hummus, if you don't already know, it's chickpeas. So it's it's um, plant-based. It's usually just chickpeas crushed up. They've got original. They've got some flavored ones. I mean, garlic or roasted red pepper, okay to do. But these are great. Um, this is such a great thing to do on celery and, and um, cucumbers and... Uh, red peppers and things like that. So, and this is also like Kelly said, if you're gonna get, um, if you're gonna get some turkey, and we're gonna show you which turkey to get. But if you are getting some turkey at the deli, then this is something really good that I like to smash on that. Um, I actually do even um, hard-boiled eggs. I'll put my hummus. Oh, I put some hummus on hard-boiled eggs too, or something else kind of crazy. Oh, tuna. I mean, instead of mayonnaise, sometimes I'll mix the hummus mm. with the tuna instead of a mayo. All right, and but, and the plain rice cakes too. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Crunchy, like, because most people associate hummus with crackers. Yes. The plain rice cakes are good with hummus. Are a good place for crackers. So, like, see all this pita stuff? We just go right past this, y'all. I see We're not even it. seeing the path. But look at how these, look at all these death traps. Look at all these little, these booby traps that they put. Now, why are you putting Doritos in the produce section? They're trying to get us. Because this okay. is where people come in and get their lunch. Right, no, but so ignore this. All right, don't, no pretzels, no crackers, none of that stuff. We're not doing any of that. We're not even seeing it right now. So, morning, how are you? Hi. Good. We're good. Thanks so much. You have a great day. Okay, now, we're in the deli. Kelly, do you need any deli meats? This nice oh, lady I might need some turkey. Get some turkey. Okay, yes. here's what I like here. They've got to make sure it's on you. Now, this is in Jewel. Jewel has Green Ridge Farm Naturals. That's one of the best brands here. Um, Boar's Head Meats is also a really good one if you're at a different grocery store. They've got all natural, and then there's Applegate. Like if you're gonna go to a Target, Target actually in the refrigeration section, they don't have a deli there obviously, but 
you can get Applegate Farms is a really, really good one. Hi, baby. Oh, my little baby's up. I love you. Mommy loves you. I'm at your favorite place, The Jewel. Um, so Applegate Farms is a really good uh, lunch meat, too, all natural, um, that you can get at a Target. So like I said, if we're going to come to Jewel, I love this Naturals Green Rich Farm. Naturals is a really good one. Yes, um, and I really like y'all just to kind of stick with a turkey. Uh, they've got loads. It's lower in sodium um, because lunch meat's a lunch meat, y'all. It is, it is slightly preserved. There's going to be some extra sodium in it, but um, I do, I, I, I do say if you've got to, if you got to get it, get that. And then if you, we try to avoid cheese again, but if you are going to do any cheese, go with the white cheeses, go with Swisses, go with mozzarella, go with provolone. Um, they do have a Land O'Lakes American, which is lower sodium. If you've got to do it do that. If you're getting it for the kids, guys, get them that one. Okay. I'm getting so, some turkey. All right, getting turkey. We're going to go, bakery is, uh, you know, I see the bakery ahead. That's, um, that's you know, no that's go. bad. That's bad. That's, that's bad no that they put the bakery next to the produce. I'm feeling like I should talk to the Jewel people. <laughs> I think they'd want to hear from me. I think they might maybe want to hear from me and, you know, help them revamp the store. I do have a marketing degree. Um, and I did do merchandise management. I mean, I might be able to, um, you know, let them know. I don't know. Kelly, you think? All right, Kelly, I'm going to leave Kelly at the deli. Okay. Kelly at the deli. I didn't even know that was going to rhyme that. I'm leaving Kelly at the deli. Okay, leaving Kelly at the deli, and I'm going to continue with produce. So, guys, some green apples, some grapefruits I'm going to get today. Um, and I'm going to go organic. Okay, you don't have to, but, um, you know, it's a price thing sometimes. You know, I'm only going to get a couple apples, so I don't mind paying the extra for the for the um, organic. I'm going to get some organic avocados because those are going to be, you really can taste a difference with organic. But again, you don't have to go organic. Um, total preference. Um, as long as we're getting some veggies, we're good. All right, so I got some avocados. I'm grabbing some green apples. I got some spinach. We got some green salads. Okay, we're still here in, okay, I keep losing my list, guys. All right, we're still in produce. Now, I need some onions to spice some things up. So we're gonna do onions, we're gonna do garlic, we're gonna do some mushrooms. Here's some mushrooms, guys, we're gonna do. This is again where, the section where we can get um, onions and garlics because we want to spice some of the dishes up that we're going to prepare. Um, I think Kelly's going to come back here and get some bagged lettuce. Okay, bakery alley. We're not even going by there. We're going to get some sweet potatoes. All right, y'all. We're going to get sweet potatoes. We're going to try to get through here too in um, 30 minutes. All right, here comes Kel. Kelly from the deli. It's like Jenny from the block. You're like Kelly from the deli. That's what's happening today. That was a situation. Okay, we got a situation. So I got some turkey. All right, Just we got turkey. Easy peasy. All right, so. that's good. And I like that you're gonna do. Um, all right, we're gonna go. We're gonna go forward, not reverse. I was just telling too. They can get garlic. They can get onions, so that they can spice up some of their dishes. All right, boys and girls, here. Um, this is seafood. We're not gonna get any seafood today because they are they're not, not open. open. They're not ready for us. Yep, so we are not, we're not doing seafood, but we're gonna come right here. Again, we're still in the perimeter. We haven't even gone in the middle of the store yet. Okay, we're gonna get some organic. I'm gonna get some organic chicken. So here's some organic thin sliced chicken tenders. Kelly, I know you love to do some bison. Oh, I love bison. All right, so here guys, bison. It's all natural ground bison. Again, the chicken, if you didn't see it, we just did organics. I just do an organics right here. The beef that I love to buy is Laura's. This. Yeah. Laura's. I love grass. Laura's. Grass fed. Yep. Do you want um, that in your car? Actually, I'm gonna do the patties though that are already oh. done. So we're gonna do Laura's grass fed. These are patties, they're already ready to go, so I'm gonna make little burgers. Morning, Heather. Um, Hi. All right, what else do you need, sister? Um, turkey. Let's talk turkey. turkey. Let's talk turkey. If you're gonna buy turkey, I always go Jenny O. I do Jenny 99. Yeah, Jenny from Block. I do 
1% lean, 1% fat. So I get this one. This is what I do my turkey meatloaf with, so let's just go ahead and grab one of those. What else do you need here? Anything? I'm, I'm good. All right, good. They've got, I mean, guys, If you ha again, if you have to go... I always do organics with the meat. I always Me do organic and I always do grass fed. Grass I don't, fed. I don't even really think there's an option. If you have to, like again, if you have to, yeah. It's and not, wild caught. Wild caught. Seafood. Yes, we try to do wild caught yeah, seafood do all the time. Raised. Don't do farm raised. That's right. No farm raised. Yes, Rod, you can barbecue it. Just depends. Don't 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 do too much sugar on your barbecue sauce. Um, it's you can't lean. live in Texas and not do barbecue. But I'm not doing flank steak today. But I do flank steak because it's very lean. Oh, look at Missy of... Hoffman got jokes. Ninety nine problems, but Jenny O ain't one. I like that. Wow, girl. that's my girl. <laughs> Represent Ariana Grande this morning. Okay. <laughs> All right, wait, what was that? Back it up. I'm that sorry, was flank me... steak. Flank steak. It's Ooh, very lean. Like flanks... Yes, it is. Um, there's not a lot of fat, and it's easy. I mean, I'll throw in the crock pot this time of year, but I also throw it on the grill. I love it. Oh, yeah, it. yeah, yeah. Why does my hair look so short? I don't know. I think it looks not. beautiful. Doesn't Kelly look beautiful this morning? Okay. All right, we're still <laughs> in the perimeter. Stay stay with me, sister. Oh God, we got to get to our running. work. We got to get to the workout, I'm too. Work I don't have to warm up, uh, Nicole. You're not warming out. Yep, <laughs> Nicole, no warm up. Okay. So here, okay. eggs, we're not doing bacon. However. How do you feel about bacon? Back it up. Honestly. If we have to do bacon. Yes. You know, I love Jenny O, I'm trying to represent Jenny Jeez. O. Are you on contract? Uh, yeah, Jenny O is not paying me, by the way, but I do like, if you gotta do bacon, you gotta and do turkey bacon, I and Jenny love O. I bacon, so, I mean, I mean. And honestly, what's really great here, the sodium's not terrible, so this isn't, this isn't really bad. This is okay, I mean. It's, um, it, and it is, Jenny O or, I mean, Butterball's got one too. I mean, and you know, Butterball does turkey. So, I like right, bacon. So if we're doing bacon, kids, don't even, now look at here. Let's just talk for a second. Okay. All right, bacon. Preach. I mean, Ron Vaught loves bacon. High five. Come on, Dr. Vaught, don't tell them that. <laughs> yes, please like, tell them that. You are so, he is so nice. Quiet, don't listen to her. Shh, shh, shh. Yeah, the bacon's back. All right, okay, how about now? some eggs? eggs. Talk, talk to me eggs. about eggs. All right, we got to go. Free People range. giving us strange looks. Yeah, they really are. We got to get this bad light, too, okay? I mean, we, we didn't know that was going to happen. Okay, Whoa. so, but you know what? Honestly, we get strange looks all the time, so that's okay. I just um, So, we go cage-free, um, free range, cage-free, uh, brown if you can. Those are usually the best ones to get. Um, in a pinch, my God, look at this here, y'all. I mean, boom, here it is. Boom. Let me see this. What's this with bad the light? It's bad light. I said I can't control it. So please don't send me notes about the bad light and the bad camera. So I'm just trying to help everybody out here. All right, but here, um, organic. So these are already, dang it, they're already hard boiled for you. They're, they did it. They already boiled them and they, they peeled them too. Y'all, come on. They peel them. So get these if you have to. Otherwise, get a dozen or get two dozen eggs. Boil, boil a, boil a yeah, boil a dozen of them, and then have the rest of them to make scrambles or whatever. But I, this is my favorite brand, honestly. Oh yes, it's, I love Vital like, Farms. They yes. are definitely more expensive. They are not eighty nine cents. No, they're not. They're like five five ninety nine. But I love these. These are Vital Farms pasture raised. Man, seriously, we're in Indiana too, y'all. You might have a neighbor that seriously has a chicken, and that's so, the best way to go. Chicken. If you can find someone that has a chicken, yeah. And they produce eggs constantly. Yes. Get some eggs. Get some Fresh eggs. one. You can knock on your neighbor's door. And then ask them if they can meal prep for you too. Okay, <laughs> now, here is butter. We're going to do some butter. We're going to do real butter. Now, wait, there's this one. I love this Amish country rolled butter. Okay, Amish country rolled butter. It's unsalted. Make sure you get unsalted butter. This is a good one. We love Kerrygold. Love Kerrygold. Kerrygold is a great is a great butter again all unsalted and then my favorite 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 there's is, some ghee is my oh here's the ghee too guys we told you about ghee but ghee. not all ghee has to be refrigerated yeah i know that's kind of threw me off so but. yeah you do not have to always refrigerate this but ghee's another like alternative to a substitute um but we like this brand too this is vital farms love vital farms it's one of my faves um but pasture raised vital farms it's ghee um, that's another really great substitute to butter, guys. Okay, so how do you feel about this, Tina? Let's see. How do you feel about this? Um, okay, Kelly's asking about pure blends. It's avocado oil. Let me tell you how I feel about it. Yeah. I know people are, you know, 
drawn to anything avocado. Yeah, but I don't think so. It's not super. It's not super just natural. Like this isn't yeah. just avocado and water. It is purified water, avocado oil, soybean oil. If you've got issues with soy. This has a lot of soy. And I can't have and soy after having breast cancer. You right. can't have anything with soy. No soy. Soy is a no go for me. So see, this is a. This All is right. A, just wanted to get your this opinion. This is like a fake you out because it's got a pretty picture of an yes. avocado. And, and everybody's really drawn to avocados. Right. But that would really be bad for you. Yeah. So, so no. Good call. Bye Do bye. we need now? We're going to grab some almond milk. So we're still in the perimeter, guys. What's our time? 7 20. We got 10 minutes to check it all out. All right. She on. walks really fast. Run with, I know. You got to go. Dear Lord, have mercy. Yeah. Wait. Can I show them my creamer? Yeah. They show them your creamer. Damn. By all means. I'm going to show them almond milk while you show them your creamer. They don't have it. I'm going to kill them. They don't have it. Oh, Jewel, you failed me. Seriously, I was going to do a. What's the creamer? The yeah. creamer is like, it's got MCT oil. I know a lot of people don't know about that. MCT oil. It has protein, it has no carbs and no sugar. And I, I can't tell you the name of it, but. Oh, you're kidding. No. They don't have it, they're out of stock. No. That's well, they're kind of stocking too right now, it's early. Bum, All right, here's what we do. We do some Almond Breeze almond milk, 30 calories, unsweetened. We do an organics one. It's plain, almond milk, unsweetened. Dr. Voss said soy is um, very inflammatory. Yeah, we know that. So. Yeah. Okay, thank thanks you, Dr. Vat. Thanks, Dr. Any, any other tips, Rob? Any other tips, Dr. Vat? No, I am in front of the camera now. <laughs> thanks for driving. Anytime. Safer than you so, driving. <laughs> um, I'm not, I mean, cashew is okay. It's not like the best nut. It's okay, but it's honestly, it's not the best nut. Walnuts, almonds, pumpkin seeds, like those are the better. Um, almond and walnuts are really the better nuts. Um, and then seeds are more like pumpkin, flax, chia, but, um, so I don't usually do a cashew milk. Um, rice milk is okay if you want to do a rice milk. Um, but I do, I do usually as a go-to and I don't do a lot of it, but I do go to as a go-to almond milk and that's usually for my protein shakes. Um, I, cause I usually do two shakes. One, one shake a day I do, do with almond milk. You do two shakes a day? Usually I do. Girl, are yeah. they the little ones that I see you sipping no, on or are they normal No, not the size? baby. No. Stop I do lying. one baby one sometimes. Okay. For like, that's like my night snack. Uh, okay. Okay. All right. So we're still in the perimeter. We didn't even go in the middle section and we got to get rolling. We got to go in the middle. All right. Middle. But here Where's we are going. All we're doing here is Wait, we're doing, um. This is the brand, but look, this, I don't do the coffee. Oh, this is the brand for her creamer, y'all. Creamer. I don't do this coffee, but it's a creamer. Okay. And it's it's good. All right, good. It's a good creamer, she said. All we right. got to trust Kelly. Bye she bye. knows. All right, all I'm doing in the frozen section right here. Oh, we yeah. get some frozen. We want to get some frozen veggies. So oh, there's not a lot. All right, I'm just going to do the green beans and the broccoli right now. They also have asparagus. Um, that's another really great one. You can get that frozen, you guys. Spinach. Frozen asparagus. Frozen spinach. That's all we need to do in the frozen section. Now, here's the thing. We do have to go into the middle. But honestly, I've already been here 20 minutes. I've got most of my good foods. Now, I haven't even gone into the middle of the store. We haven't even gone there. We haven't gone through chips. We haven't gone through soda. We don't need to. You don't even need to look at it. You don't even know it's here. Okay, but we do I need... candy. She sees candy. There's freaking bread and candy everywhere, though. They trap you. They've got... The stores are set up, setting you up to fail. Chips and salsa. We don't want any. You can get salsa though. You just don't get the chips. But they put the ding 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 chips next to the salsa. It's not right. All right, here's what I do need. We need almond butter. So we're going almond butter. What the hell's right next to it? The bread. Dang it. We're not looking at the bread. We don't want the bread. Bread is not good. But we are going to get some raw almond butter. All right, so here's a really great brand. I love Maranatha. Okay, that's a good almond butter. PB2 is great if y'all want to do a powdered peanut butter um not a huge fan but if you have to have peanut butter do this or i love the natural smuckers has a really great one uh, i like smuckers natural so if i'm going to do peanut butter i try to do real pe peanut butter it's smuckers this has peanuts in it a little bit of salt but not much but that's it that's all that's in here is peanuts when y'all are looking at ingredients it should have like just the one thing that's in there and this is a great this is justin's little packet to have with you like in your car in your purse like for a snack because you know let's face it i i don't leave home without almonds or something in my car because if i do that's when i get 
in trouble. She's in with, trouble. I get in trouble and I, I feel her over her. my shoulder yeah. going, what are you eating? Do not buy any honey almond butter. Oh, God, don't no. get any honey peanut butter. Y'all don't need no honey in it. Stop it. You just stop get, it. just get almond butter. Just get raw peanut butter. Um, so now we're, we're going, we're moving. We're on the move. We got our, we got our nut butters. Um, the only other thing I need in these sections, Kel, we need, we said we wanted some tuna. Tuna would be in the can. Yep. So we got to go, we got to go canned. Canned fish. Now here's what we do with you tuna. You prefer canned over pouches? Um, How do you feel about pouches? Yeah. I mean, the pouches are okay if they've got the, yeah, here they are. I just, pouches are easy. They're super easy. All right. So here, and I love wild planet, no salt added because it is wild caught. Like Kelly said, it's got to be wild caught. It can't be farm raised. We don't know what they raised it with. What did they raise it with? Wild caught, we know, has not know, been fed that grains or anything like that. This one All right, so there's another one Kelly's eyeballing. All right, so here's what we do with the tuna. We get pouches of wild caught, no salt. Okay, so we're doing that for tuna. Watch our time. Lime. Let's go get some brown rice. Okay, following. Yeah, four minutes. Oh, dear Lord. Good morning. Organic brown rice bowls. Organic brown rice bowls. These are great. Um, they do also have pouches here. You want to show? I'm sorry, sir. Shout out to Facebook. Shout it out. Okay, he thinks He's you're not. crazy. They're calling security He's right crazy. now. We have like three minutes to get out of here. Okay. Um, what are you looking for? I was looking for. Let a me pouch. move out of the way. People okay. are starting to congregate here. Yeah. They're all trying to see what we're up to. Um. All right, here's boil in the bag brown rice. Okay, so there is a box boil in the bag if you want to boil it up. If you don't, if you're not a microwaver, okay, you can do this. All right, you can boil it in the bag. And guys, just boil a, a big bag of rice. And this is, we're going to what about quinoa? Quinoa is awesome, too. Love quinoa. They even have that boil in the bag now. Okay, so you can do quinoa Sorry, boil in the bag. You're good. Okay. Sorry, sir. <laughs> Morning. Okay, thank you, thank you. You're right. I need to stop apologizing. Stop, Girl, stop, stop apologizing. Girl, wash your face. Girl, wash your face and stop apologizing. Okay. Oh, here's some beans. All right, black beans. Now, we did say black beans are okay, and if we're going to do anything, we're going to do organics, and then we're going to open these up, and we're going to... Ooh, Dr. Vought loves sardines. A lot of Ooh. sodium, though, Dr. Vought. I know they're so good for you, but aren't they loaded with sodium? Shout it out, Dr. Vought. Give me a little something-something. I I'm listening thumbs, to Dr. A lot Dr. of thumbs Vought. up and hearts, so I love it. All right, we literally got to get rolling out of here. But um, black beans in the can if we're going to do cans. The only other thing I think I was going to get out of these aisles, we were going to get some coffee, some organic coffees. But other than that, I feel like we did really well. Right? Your we list. got everything on our list. We got brown rice. Um, some We were going to get some We'll get some raw walnuts. We're going to go to hit some raw walnuts. We're going to get some spices, some coconut oil. So, and really any, any of those, you know, you don't have to get crazy with that. Anything will do. So we just come to the store with your list. Cause if yes. you don't, you tend to veer off and get sidetracked. Oh, okay. I do. No, I, I think a lot of us do. It's so, that was like, kinda, that's for? kind of the takeaway today. Y'all, we just wanted to, again, as a follow up from last week, we were in Kelly's kitchen. We were meal prepping. We were showing you some of the things we actually prepped, but we did say the key was to plan it. You gotta plant it, you gotta go pick it up, you gotta prep it, and then you gotta pack it and take it with you. So we we have like a dance. Right. We did, so we did mm. we did go we did put our list together last <laughs> night. We said let's get our list together. And basically y'all what I what I do, it's like, what's my week gonna look like? I mean, I'm working all week. Um, where do I need meals? Do I need where do what what where do I need to prep my meals and what meals do I need to have prepped because what are my days gonna look like? Yeah, what do I need to eat? So I did I did that I did that thought process in my head. If you watched me yesterday, I was at Dyer Nursery with all my kids. I mean, those moms have to pack snacks for their kids all week, all week every day. So if you're packing for your your kids, I mean, why aren't you packing for yourself and, and preparing for yourself? So we planned our list. We, we came in, we're shopping for it. Now we're gonna take it home. We're gonna get it all prepped up and we're gonna, you know, we're gonna pack it and eat it this week. So we hope that this helped. Um, that's really all That's really all we're here to do. Facebook, believe it or not, is not paying me to do this. Um, I'm really just here because I wanna, I wanna help my friends, I wanna help my clients, I wanna help anybody out there that I can. Um, and just show you, it, it doesn't have to be so complicated, y'all. We don't have to, it doesn't have to be so complex and so overwhelming. 
we can do this. We all come to the grocery store, just buy, buy the right things. And I hope today helped. And if you have any questions, please always feel free to reach out to me, message me. And I'm for hire if you want me. me to shop for you or prep for you yes. for, while I'm around Use until this, I move. girl, she's here. Until she's I move got to St. nothing Louis. to do. I got a big, she's gonna work out big honking kitchen. Yeah, she's gonna work out and then so. she's got another, you saw her cute, she's got a nice kitchen. So give house Kelly a for shout sale. out. Okay. House is for sale, but before she sells it, we'd like to get her um, on the payroll. So. <laughs> Um, if, I'll shop for you. If, if, let me know if you need anything. You, you call me with any questions or shout out. Um, I'm going to be at Midwest Fitness and Training tonight. If y'all want to come work out with me, five and six o'clock tonight. Um, I'm heading there at eight. To do look for our emails. I always do our email recap. So if you um, don't, if you don't get the emails already, please go to sensationallife.com and subscribe to the email list, and you'll get all of our recaps of everything that I we talked you, about Lynn. and did today. So, um, and I'll put that in the. It's going to be in the. Um, it's going to be in the feed too, so you'll know what the website is. You, if you couldn't watch this today, um, or you know somebody that you wanted to watch it, either of course you can replay it later, or we're always on YouTube. So I will see y'all next Friday. I don't know if Kelly's right. coming back with me or not. I mean, she, you know, I don't know what if, I'm doing. If Michael's not around, she's coming. So love you all. Have an amazing weekend and a great weekend. Do do the right healthy thing. Bye. Bye.